So just getting ready to start a print on here and I realized that I'm about 15 prints in and I usually like to reapply my nanopolymer, which is this stuff. So I use this on the PEI. These are the flex plates. And this one's about a year old, so they do last long if you take care of them. But for ABS on these, because ABS doesn't really like to stick to PEI, I like to put this stuff on it. So you can wipe this down. As you can see, there's still some nanopolymer on here. But I like to just reapply it. So you take the cap off, and you want to do like a circle and then an X, okay? I'm a little generous with it, but then you take the brush, okay? And then you just brush it on and it will evaporate quicker if you have heat now the only thing I don't like about these brushes as you can see is sometimes there's little bristles that come off with it but you can just flick them off with your finger if they bother you but that's it so now the nanopolymer is applied it does evaporate quicker if you have heat um, you can also apply it at room temperature. It just takes a little longer to dry because um, this is like an alcohol base, so it does evaporate naturally. But now I've got a nice coating on here. I'm ready to start my next print. And I just figured I'd post a quick little video showing you guys how to actually apply it. And this will work with ABS, PLA, PETG, literally any material type. I haven't found a material that does not work well with. Um, and this is nice for putting down between PETG and PEI if you want to avoid any possible damage to the actual PEI surface or even like, you know, these polycarbonate type sheets. So hopefully this quick little video is helpful and I'm going to get the next set of Hero Me parts started right now.